Time to whip out those dildo swords. This is the Saints Row Chronology in three minutes. Let's begin. 2006, Stillwater City. An unnamed man called only the Playa witnesses a massive bloodbath involving the city's three main gangs, Los Carnales, Vice Kings, and the West Side Rollers. He is saved by Julius from Third Street Saints, a small gang attempting to put an end to the ceaseless gang war in Stillwater. The Playa is recruited by Julius and taught the ways of the street. He crusades against the three gangs, destroying them, earning all the city's turf for the Saints. The Playa, in an effort to prevent Julius from being arrested, kills the mayor of Stillwater and the corrupt chief of police. But he's caught after an awesome yacht explosion. Extreme! He is arrested by Hughes, who tricked the player into killing the mayor. Wanting to take over Stillwater, he kills off important members of the Saints. After awakening from a coma caused by that extreme explosion, the player breaks out of Stillwater Penitentiary to find three new gangs that have taken over Stillwater, and the three Saints have disappeared. It's almost like everything you did was for nothing. Thanks for buying our games. The player busts his right-hand man, Johnny Gat, out of prison and begins a new war with all three gangs. The Old Tour Corporation, a malevolent company that uses its private army to wipe out gangs and solidify their iron grasp on Stillwater. The Playa destroys the three new gangs and Old Tour Corporation, taking over total control of Stillwater in the process once again. What's that? You didn't want to play the first game over again as a sequel? Well, ask and you sure as shit will receive. The Playa discovers that Julius sent him on the yacht with the extreme explosion and in a final act of rebellion, executes him. Extreme execution. The Thus eliminating any potential for competition in Stillwater. Because there are no rival factions left in Stillwater, the Saints Row grow into a massive corporation, rivaling that of the now partnered Earl Tour. The Saints use their fame like a brand to sell energy drinks, bobbleheads, and clothing, and keep themselves relevant by deciding to attack another city, Steelport. After the Saints rob a bank owned by a new rival faction, the Syndicate, Johnny Gat is killed, and the Saints vow to destroy the Syndicate from the ground up and destroy another three factions in order to conquer Steelport. As the gang war escalates, a special government military force called Stag is brought in to put the Saints and their rivals down. The Saints outmaneuver Stag and save the town, putting them in good terms with the public eye. Wow, that turned out way better than it should have. Years later, the Saints work with the government, because of course they do. The Playa is eventually elected as President of the United States of America after saving the world from the former leader of Stag, who has gone insane and tried to nuke Washington, D.C. Once elected, the Earth is attacked by the Zin Alien Intergalactic Empire. What the fuck? The player is captured and placed in a machine, forcing him to experience simulations. He escapes and calls for reinforcements, angering the Zin. So they blow up the planet. Once again, making everything you had done beforehand completely pointless. Thanks for buying our games, you stupid shit. Swearing revenge for Earth, the player dives back into the simulation to defeat the Zin and rescue his allies. The Saints discover Johnny Gat is not dead and recruit him for the final assault on Zinyak, the Emperor of the Zin. The player defeats Zinyak by tearing his head off. Extreme decapitation! Using time travel, the Saints visit Earth before it was destroyed, and that's pretty much it. So that was Saints Row, and I am done using this voice. Jeez. Anyway, are you guys looking forward to Saints Row 5? I mean, what are they gonna do after the Earth exploding? Let us know down below. And if you like this video, check out another video I narrated called F Zero in Three Minutes. Surprisingly, that story has convoluted levels of Kingdom Hearts. It's insane. Make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one.